Cody, how's it feel to be back for season two of the Go Big Show? Because you've had a great 2021, starting it off with a bang in 2022. I think uh, I'm walking into season two really with a, almost a sense of uh, arrogance and bravado <laughs> over I've seen season one. I've seen some of these amazing acts. Now I've got to know exactly the criteria I've set out in front of me for who's going to win $100,000. I'm sure I'm wrong about that uh, arrogance and bravado, but uh, I, I really know the show more. I know the show more and I know what I'm looking for. And I have somewhat of an indication what Jennifer and Rosario might be looking for. A T-Pain wild card, not entirely sure, but that's the beauty of, uh, of this second season. Exactly. And you come into this second season as a TNT champion as well. So, oh. I mean, it's kind of nice to come into that. What good synergy. What what good synergy to, to, to win the TNT title, my favorite belt in wrestling for the third time. Uh, very, very, what a good season. You know, as a wrestler, I felt like I lost a lot uh, in terms of at certain points in my career, a lot of times you're looking up at the lights and whenever you are, you're thinking about how you're just going to run up the score at some point that you're just going to go nuts. You're going to leave everybody in the dust. And uh, when those moments come up, when you are having a great season, when you are winning, when you're promoting a show that you're involved with, you got to pinch yourself just how special it really is. Yeah. And how was it working with T-Pain since he's the newest judge on the show? I just love that T-Pain... Uh, I figured myself would probably be involved with most of the acts because I I'm pretty Guinea pig like in terms of, ah, oh, Cody will do it. Cody will do it. Uh, he he's involved with more acts than Jennifer, myself, Rosario. And that, that really showed that he was going all in. Uh, I mean, the, he doesn't have to, he's T pain. Just him sitting there is a special uh, honor to have him on the panel, but he really dove in and, and, and ingratiated himself in the, Go Big Show uh, family. And uh, I, I think people are going to get a kick out of them. Yeah, and you've been able to bring a lot of the judges on AEW for Dynamite. Yeah. We talked to Jennifer Nettles not too long ago. Are you trying to get her on the show next? So I don't know what it is about. She's like uh, the she's the white whale right now in terms of Rosario came on and T Pain handed me a chair uh and snoop last season uh you know but bert and jennifer i've got to figure out what it is they want out of wrestling because ultimately everyone on go big shows got to make a trip and this season not only did you know rosario was on uh t-pain was on but we actually also on AEW dark we had one of the contestants from go big show season two uh on, on the show so just I like to link all my worlds together, especially as a wrestler, because I want to show people what wrestling really is mm -hmm. and not perhaps what they have thought it is. And that, that's one of my favorite things to do is, is to turn heads with this industry that uh, I've been in my whole life. Yeah, and it's great synergy between both shows as well, because it really does show a lot. One thing I do want to ask you, though, AW has been so popular. Such a short amount of time has really made a major impact in the sport what do you think it is that has really attached fans because i watch it every week and i love it i think you guys are doing a great job behind the scenes at aw is a very organized disciplined team effort mature effort you have a lot of wrestlers uh in their mid-30s who have been doing this for years and years and years and have just now become like master artisans at what they do but on the screen it appears as no rules wild west authentic as hell pro wrestling and those those pieces make it we've been so lucky that the show's gotten so popular and supersedes expectations but when i talk about it it's almost scary because that just means we have a responsibility to keep doing that i mean we're three years in and i'm the executive vice president one of the executive vice presidents of this beautiful beautiful upstart wrestling company that has provided the alternative that wasn't there in 20 years that that's not something i thought i'd ever say and again i'm uh, we're very blessed awesome thank you so much for stopping with us really appreciate it great job on everything see you january 6th on the go big show and what quick question aw when is it coming to the west coast uh i can tell you without much of a spoiler and i hope no one gets mad at me just hang on for a few more months and I bet there'll be a big announcement. Uh, hey, 
but that's just for me. It's not coming from AEW or anything like that, but AEW is making its way. Just hang on, hang on. Can't wait. Thank you so much. Thank you.